In this video, I'm going to make a wooden face plate to replace the metal one that I'm using on the back of my disc sander, my lathe attachment. I'm going to use uh, a block of beach and I'm going to drill a 17mm hole through it and then I'm going to start the threads off on the drill press to keep everything square. Once the threads are started, I'm going to have to finish off by hand because it gets quite hard to do. I'm keeping the threads, not putting any lubricants in because I want the threads to be dry because I want to run some super glue onto the threads to harden them and this serves two purposes, obviously it does harden them and also if you um, grease it out your head stock then it doesn't contaminate the threads and make them expand just going to now run the, the super glue into the into the hole so it covers all the threads and, and, and not using any uh, any accelerator on this and we'll just let it dry naturally so it, so that it coats all the fibers once it's dry we're going to um, recut the threads just recut the threads now in the video I'm just knocking the corners off on the block of wood so make it easier to turn on the lathe. Uh, this is not really accurate, whatever you want to do. Uh, I've put a nut on the back of the head, of the head stop to stop them from the clearance. Now, now I'm just going to turn it down to a required size, any, any size will do. Turn the blank over now. Just putting the round on the back edge. I made the front part with this by spinning it on the route on my route table. I made a video of this, and you can check that out on my channel. I'm going to use a towel stock to press it on once I've glued it, and then leave it overnight to set. I'm using PVA glue, so there's a slow set anyway. Now uh, this is the video of the uh, spinning the disc. Part or part of the video of spinning the disc I should say. Uh, that's about it for the for the um, face plate. If you enjoyed the video please like and share and please subscribe. I've cut a nut in half as a thread stop for the um, Head stock. I didn't want to leave the big nut on, it was too it was pushing the face plate out too far, so I've cut it in half and um, it's giving me about five to six mil clearance. 